Hello everyone, today is July 12th, Friday. Uh, it's a beautiful day here at Pelican Sound. We are at the golf club. I want to showcase some of the things that have gone on this week. I'll take you inside, but if you can see just behind us, they're still working out some of the framing so we can start stuccoing on the sides of uh, the uh, Portica Share area. And uh, I'll work around the backside as well. But a lot of things have been accomplished this week. We are located right outside the pavilion, and I want to take you inside the kitchen. The pizza oven was uh, delivered uh, this week. Uh, they had to put it in early so we can get it in before uh, because the space needs to be uh, fairly large in order to get it inside. So let me take you inside now. Uh, for protection purposes, we've covered it, but you can kind of get the idea. Uh, the opening for the pizza oven is about uh, this big here, and it's about eight feet across. Uh, plenty of space to be able to make some uh, pizzas. Um, and as far as how this is going to look, we're going to have uh, subway tiles, uh, blue subway tiles on the side here. It'll, it'll match up right up to the uh, side of the pizza oven. And uh, this is the location where the controls will be. But if you're coming up from the, uh, the golf side, you'll be walking right up and you'll see right into the pizza oven. So it's gonna be a kind of cool experience. We'll be making the pizzas over here and then uh, placing them in here. And as far as where the pickup window will be, which we're still working on right now. Um, so this is the, what we call the expediting window. So we'll be making the pizzas and the, any of the other food items and bringing it over here and the expediter will take it out to your table. Uh, Pavilion space. This is where the dining area will be. Above us, they're still working on some of the details, but all the lighting has been installed and all the electrical for putting in the fans. And then uh, the fire sprinklers uh, are they're working on that right now. But pretty soon we'll be able to button this up and put the tongue and groove ceiling around here. So it's coming along, and then they'll start working on the stucco around the frame. If you notice, all the windows are installed on this side, so we'll be able to start stuccoing the side of the building very shortly. And just behind us here, uh, this is the overflow seating for the pavilion space and the uh, extra seating for outside the pro shop. They started to grade this area. Obviously, we've had some rains that uh, has helped along us the way, but we'll have uh, pavers in this area. And then this is an area that we'll be able to do uh, some music and some entertainment uh, in the near future. So it's coming along and we're getting a lot of progress. We are located right outside the the uh, Pelican Pub. This is the covered area. Uh, behind us, they're starting to put in uh, the frames for the uh, windows and doors. So you can see uh, that they're, they have the frames in and being installed. So once the frames are in, the, they can finish uh, doing the stucco. And once the stucco is complete, then we can start working on some of the uh, downspouts for the gutters. And then we can really start working on some of the landscape and the rest of the paver area. So we really need the, uh, the doors to go in now, and then we'll fill that up with the, uh, the stucco on the side of the building. Then we can finish up with the gutters, and then we'll finish up doing the grading over here on the back side of the clubhouse with uh, the landscape, and then finish up on the pavers on the back side of the clubhouse. And you can see behind me, we have a lot of the door frames going in right now. This is a great sign. Uh, this is what we need. These are called uh, Euro doors. So they fold all the way out. Uh, and you can see that they're starting to put the frames in. They're going to put them on the wall. And as soon as we complete that, we can start doing the stucco and then the downspouts and the less of the flashing above us. We're in the Lakesview room. You can see behind us the, the drywall is still uh, being prepped up. They're doing the uh, skimming of the walls, getting it all prepped for paint uh, in the near future. As soon as we get the doors uh, being installed, which is should be completed by Tuesday. Uh, they'll start be able to paint interior portion of this building and get it uh, all prepped and ready for the next phase. We're located in the main kitchen. Uh, they're still working on some of the prep work of getting uh, the drywall all ready prepped for uh, all the interior space here. Uh, they'll be pretty soon putting up the backing, which is FRP, which is a, a resistant to uh, water and fire. So they'll be putting it on these back walls in the near future, so you'll see a lot of progress soon. We're located in the men's restroom. This is just right outside the lobby. You can see below us, they have the uh, ProFlex uh, 90 down. Uh, this is all getting prepped, so we can start putting in the tile on the floors. 
So they have this completed for the men's and ladies' restroom. So we'll start seeing tile go down very soon. And then uh, we'll start getting tile on the sides of the wall uh, where you see all the dirt rock around. We're located in the electrical room. You can see a lot of work has been done. Behind us, you can see that the Eaton controls are in. This is part of our lighting system. Uh, we have a lot of uh, functionality in our lighting system. We'll be able to dim at di different levels. So it's going to be a lot of uh, great things to come and uh, we're moving along. We're located right outside the administrative offices. You can see behind us, they are putting the uh, material. It's a waterproofing agent. It's called Stow Gold. Uh, they'll apply it to the exterior portion of the building and then the, we'll be adding the uh, Dura Rock uh, to give it the, uh, the look of the uh, stucco finish and then we'll be painting it the, uh, the, the building color which is uh, a neutral ground. So you can see behind us they started with a good portion of it. Um, so they'll go all the way around the whole perimeter um, and get it all uh, prepped up. And I'll show you uh, what's going on inside. We started to get some of the flooring in and tile work. So let me show you what's going on. Uh, we're located we're just outside the administrative office. You can see that they started pouring the concrete. Uh, we did have to adjust um, to make this work for ADA compliance. So we will have a railing uh, that will take you up to the administrative offices. But let me take you uh, into our exterior bathrooms that we have over here. You can see a, a good amount of the tile work has been complete. If you go over here, you can see that uh, a lot of the prep work has uh, started and uh, they'll start putting in uh, some more of the details very soon. And you can see uh, that the uh, we're inside the administrative offices that started working on the laminate flooring. This is very similar to what we've done at the uh, racket center. Uh, we do have it starting to go through uh, some of the areas. Uh, they'll start working into the office spaces um, and then we've uh, done some tile work as well. So uh, it's coming along. Uh, we'll start doing some base uh, work pretty soon and then we'll be able to do some of the ceiling tile and then also uh, the painting of the, the building as well and in the interior painting as well. We are located at our new Pelican Sound Park. You can see behind us a lot of the grading has uh, continued. Uh, we did have to remove a little bit of the uh, dirt. Um, it's actually good fill dirt that we'll be able to use at a later date uh, on some locations on the golf course. Um, but the levels are pretty good of where we need to go for pitching, um, for water flow and all those type of things. So the next process, pretty soon you'll start seeing uh, drainage pipes going in, uh, followed by the base rock we need for the paver layout. And then we'll start getting in some of the uh, sprigs for the, uh, for the um, celebration grass. So it's coming along and it's going to be a really great product once it's all complete.